Let's solve this equation for y. Remember your steps for solving. Since this has a fraction in it, let's go ahead and multiply both sides of this equation by the LCD. The least common denominator is 3, so I'll multiply the left side of this equation by 3 and the right side of this equation by 3. Now what happens? 3 times 1 third, that becomes 1, and so the left side simply becomes y plus 3. It's 1 times y plus 3, which is simply y plus 3. The right side is 3 times 4y, which is 12y. Now we don't have any parentheses, so we want variable terms on one side, numbers on the other side. If I subtract y from both sides, I will have variable terms on the right and constants on the left. So let's take a step. Here is my left side of my equation. Here is the right side of this equation. I'll subtract y on the left, subtract y on the right. Now y minus y is 0, y or 0, so on the left I have 3, and then be careful, this is 12y minus y. If it helps you, remember that's 12y minus 1y, and so that is 11y. Then how do I finish solving? I divide both sides by the coefficient of y, which is the number beside y, and that is 11. Because that's 11 over 11, which is 1. 1 times y is y. So I have 3 elevenths is y. My solution is 3 elevenths. I'll let you check by going to the original equation, replacing y each time with 3 elevenths and making sure that a true statement results.